Hi guys. So, I tried all new products today by We Dad or We Dad. I'm not sure how you pronounce it. And I'm very happy, I must admit, if you'd like to see how this moment, this quarantine look, has been served, then you can keep on watching. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, so today I'm gonna be doing um, my hair with all new products, okay? It's all from the same company, brand, whatever. We dad. We dad. Hmm? So I'm gonna be using this stuff today. I don't know, I've never used any of their products, literally. So I kind of went on a whim, AKA a um, shopping spree on Ulta.com when I went to look for one leave-in conditioner, like a new one, because I haven't had one that I'm like in love with lately. So that's what I did. And then I ended up just three products later, okay? If you guys have ever tried it, I'd love to like hear what you think about them. I mean, the one thing that I will say is that the size of these bottles, excuse me, the size of these bottles are small, okay? Like, I don't know about y'all, but like, for sure with conditioner, this size is just not gonna last. It's just not. I should mark my calendar and see how long this works. Okay. But, so, I got a leave-in conditioner all curl types, moisture lock, okay? And my hair's been really dry lately because it's been really hot in LA and it's dry, we're in the desert, so there's that. But um, I got leave-in, I got the conditioner, which is for tight curls. I got this stuff, which is whipped curls, daily conditioner and primer. And I was, I clicked on this because like, I loved mousse in high school a little too much. So I was curious about what it was. Um, and this stuff is not like actual mousse texture. It's not like a foam. Um, it's like, it feels like conditioner kind of, okay? I'll just show you like a little bit. I kind of put some out, but see? Is that working? Do we know how to, oh, sorry, let me, oh. So yeah, it's like, um, it's literally like conditioner. And it smells really good. Um, but you could either use it as a conditioner, like while you're in the shower, whatever, or, and then like rinse it out obviously, or you can use it as a primer for your leave-in conditioner, which means you would use just like a small amount because it says a little goes a long way, which I appreciate, okay? Um, and then you leave that in and then you add your leave-in and that's supposed to like help like seal it, I guess, I don't know. We'll see how it goes, because I'm gonna use these three products, along with just like, I don't even think I'm gonna shampoo my hair today. I did it like a few days ago, kind of. So, that's where we're at. This is what we're doing. They also, which was nice also, I appreciated they gave me this for free, which is a dry oil, dry oil mist. So for in between times when it's like crusty up there, we're good. Yeah, I'm gonna just like go take a shower, that's number one, and then wash my hair. Then I'll show you guys the results. I may or may not show you guys how I apply it. We'll, we'll see. I probably should. We'll, we'll think about it. I might cut this whole part out. <laughs> okay, see you soon. Goodbye. Okay, so I just took a shower. I actually did just decide to shampoo my hair. And the conditioner actually was really, really rich, so a little went a long way, which was really nice. But I did section it and then distribute it and then comb each section out. And I think that's helpful with like a thicker formula because if you like have too much thickness and you just try to put it all in, it doesn't distribute like a lot unless you, you have to do it section by section kind of thing. I will try this stuff. To use, apply a small amount to damp hair, comb through and style as usual. And then I'll go in with leave-in after. So I'll show you guys. I'm scared. Okay, I'm gonna start with this amount and see what happens. Oh, look at this. It's like a conditioner. There it is. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's sticky. 
And what I like to do with the top of my hair, because it's so flat, especially like since I've been growing it out and there's no layers anymore. Oh, here's my comb. Flat brush. It's a shower one. It's really good. But yeah, so I'll just comb it through like it says. Um, but yeah, with the top of my head, so I'm trying to like whisper so it's not so echoey in here. Um, I'll do it on the next step, but I usually will like flip my hair and then comb, go like this and comb the top downwards and then just flip my hair back and let it dry like that. I think I'll just use a little bit more of this. And then I'll just like actually flip it now to so I encourage it to not be so flat. <laughs> so I'll just do the top like towards the ground and then kind of flip it like that and then you know what I mean? Give the give the roots some air. Now we'll do the weave-in and here's my hand full of hair. I can't do anything in life without shedding. Oh, let me see exactly what it says. I like instructions. Apply to damp hair in sections. Do not rinse out. Okay. So, let's start with this as a section. All this stuff smells really nice too. But I'm gonna do that same thing where I like comb it upside down, flip it, and let it. Let it rock. I still don't know how long that conditioner is going to last me, realistically, because it is a small bottle, but it's nice to know that, like, it is a thicker formula, so it actually, like, distributes, like, more than you would think. Okay. Squeeze them in. Okay, I'm going to just comb it really quick while it's still... Actually, a little more. Story of your life, huh, curly girl? Can't get enough. <laughs> yeah, the back is always low. So, like that. I like the curls to kind of bunch together. And then I'll kind of use the excess to just like smooth. The edge, the edgery. But that's it. I'm gonna try my best not to touch it. Cause you know, it's tough, but I'll see you guys in a few hours when it's dry. See what happens. Ooh, okay. Hey guys. So it's been a few hours. My hair is 90% dry now. Um, I'm gonna be fluffing it next because whenever I like actually do my hair and Put all the products in it's kind of like this at first especially now that i don't have layers but looky here it almost like gives you like a um like a gel hold kind of but it's not gel and i'm not really like a fan of gel at this point in my life it's just like an extra extra step that i don't really like to do and also it usually like makes my hair feel like dried out but my hair is still like i'm trying not to mess with it too much but it feels like a like a soft gel hold which is cool. I think, I don't know which exact product is, does that, but I enjoyed all the products, which is good. I'm just, like I said before, like interested to see like how long they all last, you know? <laughs> but yeah, so now I'm just gonna fluff it with my pick. But look at that before I like, I might mess it up, but we'll see. So I'm just gonna flip her. And then I have my old pick. And then there we go. See, that's the moment that I was waiting for. Okay. Because my roots get all flat and junk. 
which is fine. But ah, hi, hi, we dad. And it's still like, and that's what I like the idea of it having like a gel type hold because then realistically it'll last longer, like more days, you know. Sometimes when I just use leave-in conditioner, it's like solo. By day two, they're still okay, but like still like they start to frizz out, you know. It's not as much control going on. But yeah, the lighting might be bad because the sun is now right there. But yeah, um, I would recommend these products. It's, I mean, it really depends on your budget and how much product you actually need. Luckily, those really do kind of go a long way, which is nice, because um, they are thicker uh, formula, but I am not mad at these, at this at all, at all. It's been a while though also since I've like actually taken time to like have my hair like done, like with like the same line also, like I'm sure that helps a lot too, but <sighs> yeah, and now I, all I need is a haircut. <laughs> Or a little trim but yeah that's this is it I don't know what else to say about it but thank you guys for watching and I hope if you're in the mood to splurge which I don't think any of us should be right now but here we are yeah that's all okay love you guys bye